welcome back to my channel. My name is Allie, if you have not been here before, and thanks so much for watching this video. Today I'm gonna to be sharing my five favorite spring trends for the 2024 season. I don't know about you, but I for one get a little bit intimidated when I see these trends first go down the high fashion runways, because let's be honest, I'm not wearing an avant-garde dress with five inch heels every single day. <laughs> so that is why I wanted to share how I incorporate these trends into my everyday style, and I'm so excited because today's video is sponsored by Quince. Quince is actually a new brand to me and I truly do not understand how it's taken me this long to check out their stuff because oh my gosh just wait till you see what I have to show you today. <laughs> if you're unfamiliar, Quince is an affordable luxury brand that focuses on quality and sustainability and offers a strong selection of transitional pieces perfect for your capsule wardrobe. And their spring capsule collection is full of so many incredible pieces, so make sure you guys check out those links in my description box before everything sells out because I have a feeling the new stuff is gonna go quickly. And I have to mention one of my favorite things about this brand, they offer free standard shipping on all orders as well as 365 day returns. So literally you have nothing to lose. Before we get started, please make sure you subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Hit that notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I'd so appreciate that. And leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite look from this video was. As always, I will definitely be sure to link all the pieces I'm sharing with you guys today down in the description box. My Instagram, TikTok, Poshmark, all that great stuff is also linked down below. And I think that's it. Let's go ahead and get into these trends. The first trend that I'm extremely excited about for this spring season is girlcore. I'm talking bows, rosettes, ruffles, lace, all the girly silhouettes. I love this trend so much because you can go all out, just super girly, or just simply take little elements from the trend and incorporate it into your look. If you know me well, you know that I love to take something girly and add a little bit of edge. Case in point, this stunning dress that I'm wearing from Quince, it has the most feminine silhouette, but I think the black color just gives it a little bit of edge, which I absolutely love. This dress just screams girl core from the poofy little sleeves, the ruffle detail. It also has this really beautiful bow here on the front and the waist just like cinches you in perfectly while still comfortably. It also has elastic here in the back. And then the skirt is just so fun and flirty. I love the midi length on me. I think this dress is just a perfect modern take on the girl core trend that definitely feels casual. You can dress it up too with a pair of heels. Would be a great option with a pair of heels for a guest of a wedding. To lean in a little bit more to the girl core trend, I'd style this dress with a really cute pair of Mary Jane ballet flats. But I do wanna lean in a little bit more. So I have this really cute little pale pink bow barrette that I'm going to add to my hair and then last but not least I have this very cute little clutch bag that also has a little crossbody strap so you can wear it as a little crossbody like so or I also like to tuck in the straps so it gives you more of like a clutch vibe it is real leather and it is so beautiful I absolutely love the woven detail and I love that there's versatility as well and here is the final look this is how I would style the girl core trend I think it is so adorable so feminine and so sweet but there is definitely a way to modernize it and work it into your everyday style. The next trend that I'm super excited to share with you guys is athletic prep. The preppy aesthetic is definitely here to stay, which I am not upset about, especially as it relates to incorporating it into athletic wear. I love wearing active wear, not only for working out, but also wearing out of the house. And this trend is so great because it can take your basic workout set and totally transform it into a polished chic look. Okay, let me start by saying I am extremely picky about my active wear, like extremely. And if I'm being honest, as I was browsing through the Quince website, I was like, oh yeah, yeah, it's a cute set. I love the color. I like that it's a matching situation. And even though the reviews are absolutely glowing, like I said, I'm extremely picky. So my expectations are a little bit low. <laughs> oh my gosh, when I tell you the moment I put this burgundy set on, I was already reaching for my phone so I could look up other colors because I am obsessed with this set. Truly, not lying, this might be the best activewear I have ever put on my body. Not only is this material so soft and so comfortable, it also has the right amount of compression, so I feel really secure in this thing, and oh my gosh, the best thing in the world is these leggings 
do not slip down. They stay exactly where they need to be. I actually wore this exact set on a hike last week. When I tell you, I was absolutely obsessed. It was the perfect set for hiking. My leggings did not slip down once. I felt so secure and like, hello, so cute. Like this set is everything. I'm wearing this really cute high neck crop top. It also has like a built-in bra in it. Cute little racerback style as well. These leggings are seriously perfection. Like I mentioned, they do not slip down at all. They're so comfortable on. And I also love this little matching jacket. It's so adorable. I've always wanted something like this. It's got the cute little thumb holes as well. Pockets, the zip, which is probably one of the most genius parts of this. I feel so cute and so comfortable in this thing. I'm obsessed. So obviously this is like a perfect workout set. So how are we going to transform it into an athletic preppy look? Let me show you. So I am going to remove the jacket for this, even though I'm kind of sad about it, so cute. The first thing I'm going to do is add an oversized wool blazer, and then I'm going to take this very cute little striped sweater, kind of drape it over the shoulders. From there, you could add some chunky jewelry, add maybe a baseball cap, a really cute bucket bag. And this is a great way to style that athletic preppy look while also remaining so comfortable underneath. Also amazing if you're planning on going to like a workout class after a lunch or something, after doing some errands. I love the versatility of this set, so much so that I got a similar set in Olive and I wanna show you guys how I take that athletic preppy look and style it in a modern way for travel. Is this not the most beautiful olive green color you've ever seen? I'm obsessed. So this set is a little bit different because I did get these scoop neck sports bra equally obsessed like truly so cute nice little racer back otherwise the leggings the jacket everything fits identical to the burgundy set i'm literally obsessed it's so cute so perfect for workout but let me show you guys how i would style it for travel first i added this very cute little belt bag which is perfect for travel i love the neoprene material it is black they have multiple colorways in this one as well it's got a really cute little pocket here in the front and then a bigger pocket here why i think this is so essential for travel especially if you're flying is because you can keep everything that you need to kind of keep like grabbing out of your bag your wallet your phone your boarding pass your passport it's definitely roomy enough where you can fit all of that right in here i am an absolute disaster when it comes to traveling i swear i will throw things in a duffel or a backpack and they are nowhere to be found so i love having a small little bag like this that i can just keep my essentials in next i'm layering the workout set with a cute little denim jacket which i totally think takes the set from like workout mode to something a little bit more athletic and preppy plus i'm always cold on a plane so having an extra layer is really really nice i added a hat as well which definitely plays into that preppy kind of look plus my hair is usually dirty when i'm getting on an airplane so hats definitely necessary. And last but certainly not least is this amazing duffel from Quince. I am obsessed. It is that same neoprene material, which is just so cool, edgy, and modern. I love that it has one of those sleeves that you can slip over your suitcase handle. It also has a pocket with a little snap closure on the front. On the inside, it has a bunch of pockets as well, a sleeve for your laptop. It also comes with this really cute smaller bag. There's a zipper pocket on the inside too. And then last but not least, it also comes with a strap so you can wear it more as a shoulder bag. How could I forget? It also kind of extends. You can unclip this. And then you've got more space, which is really nice because I overstuff absolutely everything when I travel. Anyway, this is kind of how I style up my athletic wear when I'm traveling. Super functional. I feel really, really comfortable and cute at the same time, which is the winning combination for sure. And more than anything, I'm just obsessed with these Quince pieces. I think they are perfect for the spring season and honestly, every single season. And while we're chatting Quince accessories, I might as well show you guys my really cute little phone case. It's actually sustainably made from 100% plant-based, biodegradable, compostable material. And they've got four different colors, so I had to share. Sticking my phone in my little duffel bag. Somebody get me on a plane. I'm ready to travel. <laughs> the next trend I have to share with you guys is leopard print. Leopard print is a major trend this season and I am not upset about it at all. From pants to tops to dresses, shoes, accessories, I'm seeing leopard print everywhere. And hear me out. I know leopard print can be a little bit intimidating. So I think a great place to start is with accessories or shoes. For example, I have this really cute 
very old, well-worn, well-loved pair of leopard print mules. I love these because they don't like scream leopard print. The print on these feels a little bit more like a neutral. So let me share with you how I would style them. This right here to me is such a staple for the spring season. It is the cutest linen set from Quince. I think olive green might be my color this year because clearly I'm kind of obsessed. Come spring, come summer, all I wanna wear is linen. So I know these pieces will be closet staples forever. They will never, ever, ever go out of style. First, we have this very cute linen button down. I did pick it up in a size large because I wanted it to be a little bit more big and oversized. I'm wearing it with the cutest matching shorts. I love the drawstring. The pockets are so cute. And I'm telling you guys, this set is so comfortable and extremely versatile. You could obviously wear them as separates, but you could also wear this open with a little crop top underneath, throw it on over your swimsuit before heading to the beach. The options are honestly endless, but this is how I would style the leopard print trend. This outfit feels very neutral. I personally love a monochromatic look, but I think the leopard print shoe just adds a little bit more interest to the linen set. And then lastly, I would just grab this very cute little leather clutch that I have from Quince as well. Again, another really nice texture we're adding to the look. And here you have it. This is exactly how I would style leopard print if I was just really trying to dip my toes into the trend. I think it's so cute and I can't wait to get so much wear out of this little linen set with a pair of strappy heels. Oh my gosh, that would be so cute too. The next spring trend that I've absolutely been loving, you probably already guessed based on all the outfits that I've been wearing lately, but it is a ballet flat. This trend has definitely carried over from fall of last year into this year, and I am so excited about it because I have just been adding and adding to my ballet flat collection from Mary Jane's to a classic ballet flat silhouette, pointed toe, square toe, sling back. There are so many different styles to choose from. I personally really Really love this mesh Mary Jane that I just picked up so let me share how I would style it with you first we must discuss this dress that is just literally my dream I kid you not you guys this is my favorite color I love a reddish orange color I think it is so beautiful looks so gorgeous on every single skin tone I swear just try it out but beyond the color the silhouette is so pretty this totally plays into that girl core trend as well I love all the cinching here at the bodice it's got the cutest little drawstring bow here as well adjustable straps which you know I'm obsessed the length is so cute too it's seriously so comfortable and so lightweight it's going to be perfect for the spring and summer season I think the mesh flat just adds a little bit of interest to the look as well and because I'm so obsessed, I'm going to wear this very cute little quilted clutch once again. This is just one way that I would style a ballet flat that just feels so feminine and girly. But you can definitely take a ballet flat and style it with an edgier look as well. This is easily one of my favorite spring trends for the 2024 season. And I'm currently on the hunt for a leopard print pair. So let me know if you see one that you think I'd like. And last but certainly not least, my fifth favorite trend for the spring season is a statement belt. We saw a whole a lot of belts on the runways for the spring season and not just any average belt belts that felt like the centerpiece to the entire outfit i love building an outfit around a bolder accessory because it kind of allows you to simplify the rest of your look so for this last outfit i wanted to take a very simple base look just a black tank bodysuit and a pair of slouchy jeans and show you guys how this belt that I've had literally for years, probably at least like five or six years in my closet, but this belt adds so much. Can you see how my outfit just got 10 times more interesting with the addition of the belt? So I've also got those really cute little mesh Mary Janes and for the finishing touch, my quince clutch. Such a cute look. And this is exactly what a statement belt can do for your basic outfit. Adds such interest to the look. I'm so excited to take this trend into the rest of the spring season. All right, you guys, that is it. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I'd so appreciate that. Leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite look from this video was. As I mentioned at the top of the video, I will definitely be sure to link all of the Quince pieces I shared today down in the description box. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you in the next video. Bye!